Hi Shrel, I hope you are doing well. So our bot is ready for LinkedIn recruiter data scrapping. In this short video, I am going to show you a live demo of this bot that how you will be using this bot on your Windows PC. Uh, I am going to send you this zip file. First of all, you have to extract this zip file in a simple folder. Uh, like this one then now uh, follow these steps to run this bot in your windows pc open this folder and then here you will first of all you will see this keyword file here you need to open this file and here uh, you can insert your projects project links basically uh, i have inserted the workforce project link here in this file you can add more links as well Add the links, then run this exe file here. Uh, your credentials are already there. Just click the start port button. Do the two step verification from the uh, authenticator app. then uh, click this message ok after that uh, bot will start scrapping there will be two phases in first phase we will be uh, extracting the listing URLs and then we will do crawling on that URLs to scrap their data But we'll go through all the pages from here to extract the URLs. For now, uh, after this page, I'm going to stop this phase one here and starting phase 2 by clicking this button ok <clears throat> now we are in phase 2 well uh, here are the complete data columns that we will be getting from here their full name, their connection degree, which connection they have with us, their title, uh, their company, how many connections they have, complete summary of their uh, last experience, last experience position, last experience uh, timings, how many experiences they have, their skills, complete, uh, complete list of their skills, their email, their phone number, if uh, available on the profiles then we will be getting these as well their website their image URL their LinkedIn uh, profile URL public URL and their source URL that we have inserted in the keywords file for the project so these are the data columns and at the end uh, we can simply export the data in the Excel files by uh, this method and then we can open these files from here we do have the data now this is the complete process to run this boat on your end uh, just follow these steps and please do let me know if you have if you face any other problems or if you have any other <coughs> questions take care please bye bye